The Netherlands are usually not credited for being but a minor European empire. The Dutch Empire isn't exactly as influential as the French or British empires, but have colonized areas in North America, Southern Africa, and Southeast Asia. What if the Dutch Empire reunited today? Would the Netherlands be among the more influential countries? The country would encompass some or all of 27 other countries. Belgium, Luxembourg, Angola, Thailand, Senegal, Morocco, South Africa, Chile, Indonesia, India, Sri Lanka, the United States, Dominica, the United Kingdom, France, Suriname, Guyana, Brazil, Sao Tome and Principe, Mozambique, Taiwan, Iran, Trinidad and Tobago, Malaysia, Cote d'Ivoire, Ghana, and Canada. The area would be 3.61 million kilometers squared in 7th place in front of India at whole at 3.28 million kilometers squared but behind Australia at 7.69 million kilometers squared. The population would be 484 million making it the third most populous country in front of the US at whole with 328 million residents but behind India at whole with 1.34 billion residents. The GDP would be worth 6.11 trillion in US dollars, making it the third largest economy on the planet in front of Japan worth 5 trillion in US dollars, but behind China worth 13.4 trillion in US dollars. They would have an active duty military of 1.05 million strong, making it the fifth largest active duty force in front of Russia at 1.01 million strong, but behind North Korea at 1.28 million strong. They have a reserve military of 2.27 million strong, making them the fifth largest reserve force in front of India at whole with 2.1 million soldiers, but behind Russia with 2.57 million soldiers. They have a total military of 3.32 million soldiers, making it the sixth largest total military in front of China with 3.2 million soldiers, but behind Russia with 3.45 million soldiers. They would have an annual defense budget of 55.5 billion in US dollars, making it the fourth most spending country in front of India at whole, spending 55.2 billion in US dollars, but behind Saudi Arabia, spending 70 billion in US dollars. The monarch would likely remain Willem Alexander, and the capital would most likely stay in Amsterdam. The largest city would probably become Jakarta. The Dutch Empire would also lay claims to cities such as Bangkok and Chennai. The official language would probably be Dutch, while Hindi, English, Thai, Belgian, French, Spanish, Portuguese, German, Luxembourgish, Afrikaans, Arabic, Berber, Chinese, Formosan, Mandarin, Guyanese Creole, Dominican Creole, Malay, Sinhala, Tamil, and Indonesian would be considered minority or regional languages. Religions such as Christianity, Hinduism, Atheism, Buddhism, Islam, Taiwanese folk, and traditional African and South American religions would be practiced. So the Dutch Empire wouldn't really be as big of a deal as the Americans or the Chinese. They're around the size of India, have a population just above that of the United States, with a GDP comparable to Japan's. So in my personal opinion, I rank them among countries like France, Britain, Japan, and Germany, which isn't bad. And they're probably among the top of the high mid-card countries. If you like this video, please be sure to click thumbs up, leave some comments, share the video, and don't just subscribe to me, subscribe to PewDiePie as well. Thanks for watching and I'll be back soon for the next video.